Well, the old school building on Ridge Avenue has found a new purpose thanks to historic Macon and Macon Bibb County leaders. 41 NBC's Ariel Schiller has more on the restoration of the Alexander Four School and how it's being used now. The 90 year old building that used to house Alexander School number four is finding new purpose. As you can see by the new sign on the property, it's no longer Alexander School number four, it's Alexander Four Senior Living. I'm from Macon and uh, it means a lot, you know, to me just to see this building restored. Quentin Jones is the executive director for Alexander Four Senior Living. Jones says for years he wondered what the building was going to become and that he's excited to be a part of the next phase of history for the building. To see the transformation, I mean, if you ever saw the building beforehand, it's shocking to see how something that looked like that could turn into this. I mean, so we anticipate for the building to be here for many years to come to serve many seniors. The building was on historic Macon's first fading five list in 2015. The Macon Bibb County Land Bank Authority bought the building in 2016 with blight bond funds Macon Bibb Commissioner Mallory Jones designated for the project. Jones says he's grateful the building found a new use. It could have been something else. I'm glad it was this because it's a compliment and it's not a big, it's not a big commercial bustling thing that's going to interrupt the neighborhood. It's a compliment to the neighborhood. Rick Dover is the president of Dover Signature Properties, which helped redevelop the property. Dover says when he first saw the building, he knew he had to help preserve its beauty. I think when you look at buildings that are on, for instance, the Fading Five, they're there for a reason. They're there because they're significant. They're there because they're significant uh, to the history and the story of the city. And I think this is a great example of that, and we're thrilled how it turned out. And if you're wondering if there was a need for an assisted living facility, according to the executive director for Alexander Four Senior Living, they had multiple inquiries before they opened in March. And as of right now, they have about 20 residents living in the facility. And he says they expect more people to move in soon. Reporting in Macon, Ariel Schiller, 41 NBC News. Now the assisted living facility has room for up to 73 residents and historic Macon is also looking for nominations for the 2022 fading five list. The nomination deadline is June 30th. You can go to historic Macon's website at historicmacon.org for more information.